Hey Kids Nation, Pastor Michelle here with my son Roman. We are so bummed that we haven't been able to see your awesome faces the last couple of weeks, but we're so excited that we get to connect with you still with our fun crafts that connect with our weekly lessons. If you guys haven't gotten a chance to get our weekly emails, please go to cfan.church and make sure you've signed up. It's so awesome. You get a weekly worship page, you get discussion pages, you get a weekly teaching, and then we're gonna do activities throughout the week just like this, so that you can interact with us that way too. So this last week, we learned a little bit about how God made us to do great things, how he made us specific and special and with a plan. And so today, Roman and I are gonna make what? We're going to make binoculars. Yes, we're gonna make binoculars so that we can take a great adventure in the great outdoors. So Roman, what kind of supplies do we need today? So we'll need either tape or glue, some cardboard tubes, mm -hmm. a paper cutter. Only if your mommy can't cut straight like me. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> some coloring utensils if you want, some scissors, string, and if you want to decorate your tubes to make your binoculars, you can use paper and cut it out. Perfect. So Ro, I'm gonna let you start decorating okay. while I tell them a little bit more about why we're doing it. So this last Sunday, you guys got the video email about how we talked about the parable of the talents. And then we also got a chance to talk about our talents personally. And one of Roman's talents happens to be art. I bet that's similar for you guys too. And so we're going to make, <laughs> we're gonna make these binoculars so that we can go explore the great outdoors, another awesome and great thing that God created for us. So while he works on the decor, I'm going to take these tubes here, and if you have a hole punch at home, it would definitely be easier, but I certainly didn't. So we're gonna poke some holes in the sides of the tubes, just one. Kiddos, this is not something that you do by yourself. Make sure your adult person helps you. We're just gonna get right in there and cut a hole big enough so that you can string through. Oh, goodness gracious, here we go, there we go. And I have an old shoelace here because that's just what I had laying around. We're not going for Pinterest perfect. Pinterest perfect is not the goal. Making fun memories with your kiddos is. And so if you have yarn that works or some sort of string, an old shoelace also works. We're just kind of in a make it work kind of situation here. All right, you want me to cut that in half for you? No, I'm still looking at it. Okay, well we are gonna, we're gonna have to cut it in half here, okay? I'm still gonna work. Okay, one second. So we'll cut this in half, and this is gonna be the outer casing of the binoculars. Here we go. Okay, you wanna work on that there? Yes. Do you want me to put the binoculars together for you? Sure. Okay, so if you're doing this at home, make sure those holes that we just made are facing out, because we're gonna string it like this, and we're gonna take two pieces of tape. One, for the front side, and you wanna kinda of make sure that they're level on the ground or else they're gonna be a little wonky on your face. Ooh, that's pretty wrong. And then flip it over and you're gonna do one more part, piece of tape right there. If you don't have tape, then you could glue. And if you use an outer casing like we're using, it's gonna reinforce it. Woo! If you use an outer casing like we do, it's gonna reinforce it with the glue anyhow. So, ready, Ro? Yep. You wanna put this down. Okay. And you can wrap that. Can you wrap it around it? Just like a present or something? Mm -hmm. Excellent, ready? One piece of tape there. Good. Ah. That's awesome, okay. it's like a cool plaid you did. Awesome, okay. Nice, okay, so now we're gonna attach our string so that we can put it around our neck while we explore. Oh, well, you know what? Let's just make sure we poke those holes straight through the paper. All right, so we're going to make sure the holes go all the way through. And then, what's that? I think we do have a hole puncher. Yeah, we might have. Mommy just couldn't find it, you know? It's okay. So we're gonna string it through the sides. Ready? Mm-hmm. Okay, can you pull that? Yep. Awesome. And probably we need to tie a knot there. Can you tie a knot right here? Yep. Awesome. And I'll poke this through the other side while you do that. Teamwork makes the dream work. Whoop. Just gonna make sure this works. Perfect. And tie that one again. Awesome, Rowie. Great job. 
going to put those scissors aside safely. So you can make your binoculars out of paper towel tubes cut in half, out of toilet paper tubes, or if all mm -hmm. you have laying around is some paper, you could make them out of the paper by rolling up the paper and taping it too. So all that matters is that you've made some kind of fun tube. And once you're done, nice, you can put it around and you can use your binoculars to go explore the great outdoors and take a family walk. We want to see the amazing things that you find. So take a picture or a video of the things that you find. What would we see out there? Like birds, maybe? Yeah, maybe birds, some plants, maybe some cool trees. Yeah. Maybe if it's fall, you could see some green, red, or yellow trees. Absolutely. Absolutely. We want to see what you find. So take pictures and videos. Make sure to post them on Instagram and Facebook so that we can see what you found. And make sure to mention CFAN253 because just because we can't be together in person doesn't mean we can't to be together through social media. So make sure that you're posting those. Also, again, if you're not getting our weekly content, you need to make sure you are. Go to cfan.church to our Kids Nation page for our weekly videos, worship, and discussion questions and then tune in weekly for our activities and crafts. We are so excited that we got to connect with you this way, Kids Nation. We miss you. Be kind, stay safe, and well.